In these uncertain times, we're committed to sharing resources and information to help you recover from the effects of the pandemic. Tonight, KSBY news reporter Tiffany Haas spoke to Grover Beach business owners and shares how they're doing now that vehicles are allowed back at the Oceano Dunes. Many Grover Beach businesses say since the Oceano Dunes has opened back up, business has increased, but not all businesses are seeing the same impacts. After almost a year of pandemic closures, the reopening of the Oceano Dunes to off-road vehicles is bringing business back to the area. Uh, definitely a nice increase. We've been able to bring uh, employees back on, which is something that just makes us feel a lot better. With overnight camping allowed again for the popular destination, the increased traffic is providing a needed boost for local shops. Huge difference, especially today. The last couple days we noticed a significant increase in takeout and uh, delivery services, uh, food jets uh, locally owned and then uh, DoorDash. City leaders are hoping beachgoers invest their money into the local economy. We'd love to see more people come to Grover Beach and actually join, uh, uh, have a cup of coffee at a local business or uh, restaurants, uh, they're open and, and available for, uh, for takeout service and uh, some uh, outside di uh, dining options. But overall, the opportunity to have the dunes open is an opportunity for businesses to be uh, able to do more work to, and to do more business. Red Bee Coffee is also seeing more foot traffic since the reopening of the dunes. The parking lot at the end of Grand is generally much fuller and even just the traffic going back and forth on Grand is really busy. And so because of that, a lot of them come and stop by. But even after hitting a reopening milestone, some business owners are still facing restrictions. According to state parks, off-highway vehicle rentals are not currently allowed at the dunes. It means people like Wayne Foster still have to turn potential customers away. Even right now, if somebody walked in here, I could not rent them an ATV to go out there because they don't have nothing to take it out in. You know, and I can't take it out there. Despite lingering setbacks, many community members are excited to see a return to normalcy. It's just been really good. It's been really busy and we're just super happy that we've been able to stay open and keep working. The city of Grover Beach and the South County Chambers of Commerce are also participating in a buy local program where if you spend $100 on a qualified local business, you'll receive a $25 gift card in return to spend on another local business. Reporting in Grover Beach, Tiffany Haas, KSBY News.